Good day everyone. Welcome to Petrogrid's YouTube channel. Today we will be addressing how to integrate WITSML data using Microsoft's Power BI. One of the main challenges to WITSML data integration is maintaining data relationships. Both reference to the data source and the logical data relationships amongst the various data objects. Fortunately, the WITSML standard already maintains a well hierarchy relationship across various WITSML object types. Each WITSML document includes in its structure the parent well and wellbore name with their respective unique identifiers. We can leverage this feature of the WITSML standard using Petrogrid's PGXML, which includes these attributes in its automatic processing of WITSML documents. In addition to supporting a well hierarchy, PGXML also includes all the other WITSML attributes per WITSML object type. Most importantly, PGXML also assigns a unique ID to each WITSML document in order to always maintain reference to the data's original document. As a result, we can confidently combine and integrate content based on correlatable attributes amongst the various WITSML object types without losing other data relationships. To illustrate how to maintain all these data relationships, we will walk through connecting all of the PGXML generated tables together, and then visualize the data based on the common attribute of well. We will begin with an empty Power BI data model diagram, and end with a visualization page of various WITSML object types from which we can easily switch from one well to another. To achieve this, all we have to do is simply connect by document ID the various WITSML object tables to the document catalog we generated in our first video. The document catalog contains a full list of all documents uploaded into the system, along with their corresponding well, wellbore, and WITSML object type. Therefore, as we filter the document catalog by well, only the documents containing the specified well or wells will be displayed, regardless of WITSML type. We will be using WITSML data provided by Energistics that has already been processed by Petrogrid's PGXML and Microsoft's Power BI as an example application to make the various data relationship connections. Let's begin. Here we have a data model of just a few of the PGXML generated tables containing data from corresponding WITSML data object types. Power BI can be set to automatically detect existing database relationships, if any exist. But for our purposes in this video, we will perform all the connections explicitly. First, we will set the document catalog to be our master table, and connect all the other tables to it by document ID. We will select Manage Relationships, create a new relationship, select the table to connect, and the document catalog as the reference table. We will do this for each table. After connecting all of the tables, we can then create a set of visualizations and filter the document catalog by the wells of our choosing. As we filter the document catalog, the restraints will cascade to all the other WITSML objects. With this level of integration, we can now quickly and easily view all our data based on the wells we have selected. For more complex WITSML data integration, we will tackle other examples in future videos. Thank you for watching this video on WITSML data integration. If you found this video informative and helpful, please share it with others and let us know by leaving a comment below and giving this video a thumbs up. If you'd like to be kept up to date whenever we release new content, subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon. In our next video, we will be learning how to integrate and handle non-uniformly named wells, wellbores, and log mnemonics. We'll see you then.